Yo, what's up guys? Tom Zan here, back again with a new video. On today's video, I'm gonna be showing you guys on how to do the transfer glitch in GTA 5 Online. Now guys, if you're coming from a different video, go to this timestamp right here. But if this is your first time ever doing the transfer glitch, or like you never heard of it, and this is your first time ever trying it, um, just keep on watching the video, and I'll show you what to do, and you'll know how to do it. But if you're coming from a different video, or a video that I linked to this here, um, just skip to this timestamp right here, okay? So yeah, let's get into the video. Now guys, if this is your first time ever doing the transfer glitch and you don't know about it, basically the transfer glitch is um, the best way to get modern outfits. It's not like direct mode, you have to wait like 25 minutes to dupe in the birds, and then like an hour or two hours trying to find a good outfit with a Christmas mask. This one, you make the outfit and you get it. Now first thing you wanna do is go over to online and do swap character. And disclaimer, uh, when you do this glitch, you will lose your outfits, okay? That, but that's the only bad thing. But you can transfer more than um, 5 or 10 outfits. You can make 20 outfits and transfer all of them. And guys, if you're having any problems with this glitch, just comment down below or message me on Instagram. And I'll try and I'll try and help you out, okay? But now all you want to do, make sure your main character is on the first slot. If it's not on the first slot, don't even do this glitch. Just like back out the video. But if your main character is on the first slot, make your second character to a female, okay? So my first slide is the character with the red joggers and the second slot is where the female character is that's walking past the screen right now. So yeah, make sure your main character is on the first slot. Now all you want to do now, and guys if you got that previous message like the let make level 120 account or something like that, um, just press A on it, just like accept it. Make sure you make it a female and then name it whatever because you're going to be deleting this character either way, okay? Alright, so here you go, I'm just made my character and now I'm loading in. Let me speed this part up of the casino intro because this year it does take a while. So there you go, we should be spawning in now. Now guys, make sure you look at your minimap before you go to the clothing store. Now sometimes when you load into a like a public session when you make your new character, um you won't have it. All you want to do is if that does happen, um just do find new session if you can't access the clothing store, okay? Do find new session. Now guys, this here is where you make your components, okay? If you guys want to get the dragon outfit, copy everything I do. But if you want to make your own outfit, go ahead and go and make it. But if you want to get the dragon outfit with checkerboard hat and checkerboard shoes, um copy what I make, okay? So yeah. I'm right back when I finish this. So when you guys finish your outfit, make sure you save it to an empty slot on your main character. Now guys, my only full slot on my main character is slot number one. I'm gonna save this to slot number A, okay? Now if you're, let's say you're slot number one, two, three, and four, and five are full on your main character, you wanna save this outfit on slot number six, okay? And then when you guys got, when you guys save the outfit, put, um, go to outfit standard and purchase the Chica outfit. And then when you guys got that, go over swap character. I mean, I swap characters, creator, okay? My bad for that. You want to go to creator and then copy everything I do. Now, guys, if you're coming from a different video or like um, if you don't know how to do transfer glitch and you just got to this part, um, just copy everything I do, like exactly, okay? Like you don't have to worry about the names because the name doesn't matter, okay? Just write whatever you want. So there you go. Um, I put this on point to point and I make the key, I keep this on standard and I make this to two maximum two players. And then I head over to the airport because it's way more easier. If you do it like on a road, there's going to be NPC cars crashing into you and driving on the road and stuff like that. I'll just go over to the airport because um, there's going to be no interruptions when you're racing, okay? 
so place the trigger and then um, take a lobby camera if there's a red triangle next to anything just fill it out and I'll just put down the checkpoints now the minimum the race has to be is 0 0.62 okay so there you go I got I finished the thing the minimum and all I will do now is head over to test and finish the race okay so there we go I'm about to finish and now you would get an um, alert saying that, like completed all you want to do is press A on that and there you go now all you want to do is pull up your pause menu and go over to online and head over to choose character okay there you go choose character right here make sure you do not go to play GTA online if you go into play GTA online you messed up the glitch if you messed it up um, all you gotta do is delete your second character and start the glitch from start okay but if you did it correctly and picked choose character I'll um, just keep on following what I'm doing okay so here you go and all you want to do now is delete your second character so my set my second character is my female character the one I just made and all I would do is delete and rocks will make you type out delete as you guys can see I'm typing it in right now and all you want to do now is wait for this alert to finish and then when it finishes you want to back out to story mode okay um, on Xbox it's B and on PlayStation I think it's circle to back out to story mode okay so it's just spam B to go back into story mode okay so there you go I'm gonna speed this part up because the cutscene to go in story mode did take a while so there you go I'm now in story mode and all you want to do now is pull up your pause menu go over to online go to um, play GTA online and you can pick a public session or an invite only session I picked a public session but I recommend to do an invite only session because if you do a public session it's gonna take forever okay so make sure I, I recommend for my opinion do invite only session because you will load in much faster than joining a public session okay so here you go we're gonna be loading in right now here you go we're at the apartment and all you want to do now is save your outfit that well well I gotta wait until I spawn in first so here we go now all you want to do now is save the current outfit you have right now because right now it's not even saved before you do anything make sure you save it okay i'm gonna save this to my number one slot so there you go and as you guys can see if you look where the or save the juggernaut suit it's right there now i want to go to interactive menu there you guys go with juggernaut outfit right there so hope you guys enjoyed today's video and if the transfer glitch worked for you guys make sure to subscribe with notifications on for more videos like this and like today's video to support me out and yeah Tom Zion signing out. Peace.